Hi guys. Hello. Welcome back to the vlog. My name is Magical Maddie B. This is my man. His I'm name Torn. is Torn. <laughs> uh, we are staying here at Cabana Bay Resort at Universal Orlando um, for today and tomorrow. So uh, this is like future us uh, because past us already went to Volcano Bay today, but that's going to be following in the next couple of clips. So we're going to show you what we did today, but we just wanted to say hi and be in front of the sign right here. It's super pretty out here. It's yeah. like it's like nighttime now, but we're gonna have a lot of fun tonight and do some fun stuff. To so. keep watching. Yep. I'm coming. Oh my god, hi! How are you? Please come in. Welcome to my crib. Here is our door that you just walked in. I love this blue color here. You're going to head over into the kitchen. You've got a fully furnished kitchen. You've got a microwave. You've got coffee. A small refrigerator. To your living area, where you've got a fold-out futon. Two chairs. And a TV for you to enjoy. It can be split by this divider here. So that the person hanging out here on the futon, or like the parents that are hanging, drinking at the bar, can be separated if the kids are taking is mighty heavy are taking a nap if the kids are napping parents can adult out here look at you go and you can watch the universal TV look that's where we're staying that's what we just looked like checking in here's your bedroom beautiful I love the colors in here you've got beautiful blue duvets another TV a little nightstand you've got two sinks and a shower and tiny soaps. But the best part is the boy that comes in the closet. He's over here. Oh, hey, how's it going? A view, a beautiful view. That over there is Volcano Bay. Here is the pool. And uh, there's a hot tub over there. The pool today is under construction of some sort, they said. The Lazy River. The Lazy River is under construction today. but. Maybe it said they'll be open tomorrow, so we'll go check that out tomorrow. Today we're going to head over to Volcano Bay. Hi everyone! Hey! We are heading to Volcano Bay because there is a path that you can walk from Cabana Bay to Volcano Bay. And that is why people stay here, so you can walk over and enjoy yourself. So we're going to take the short walk over and be inside the water park. And then walk past it. Dice roll. So our room is right up there. We came down the elevator, walked around, and then there's this like little side road that we will be walking down. And you can see that volcano is right here. So it's super duper close. Hi, Danny. Hi. All right. Here is the resort interest for guests who are staying at Commander Bay. Please have your room card available to enter. And they also have the safety checks here. Here we are. And that's our hotel. And we're at Volcano Bay. So Volcano Bay right now is open from 10 to 5. Is that guy? So here is our tapu tapu. You are gonna wear these bad boys on every ride. Oh, and it tells me to don't forget to check my locker and return your tapu tapu at the end of the day. But uh, the return bin is right there at the exit. But I'm gonna put mine on because we're gonna wear it throughout the day and do kind of like a fast pass kind of thing with it through every entrance to every ride. Okay, great. Good job, guys. We did it. <laughs> okay, cool. There's a new picture spot. <laughs> right there. New photo spot. With the with the tapu tapu picture guy. Enter your information here. Don't look at it. It takes your picture. There's a little camera right there. It'll take your picture for you. Tap you tap. Tapu to tapu tap. And you get your picture done. Must be All right. For your Here's the view. Or in pools. Get the do not and 
be aware that you are supposed to be wearing your face coverings in dining locations, bars, merchandise, and as you exit Volcano Bay. Encourage while walking throughout the park and remove them on attractions and pools. So we have finally made it into Volcano Bay. Here is the main swimming pool here, the big main wave pool, the big giant volcano. I will walk around with this and I bought a brand new GoPro yesterday. So we're gonna get some footage in the water. I'm so excited for that. It's hot, I think it's like in the 90s again today. But we're going to the bar to get a drink first, so at least my friends are. I'll probably just get like a Coke or something, and then we will start our adventures. I haven't showed off Volcano Bay in a vlog before because you have to have a GoPro, so now that I have one, I feel like it's more worth me vlogging it. We're coming up to our first food stop, so this is one restaurant right inside the park. Koholo Reef? Mango pulled pork rib sandwich, pepperoni pizza, coconut curry chicken. That sounds good. And it's got some shady seating. The flowers here are so pretty. I love all like the foliage that they have going on here. Volcano base theming is like so pretty. And that volcano though. They also have signs around the park that can tell you ride times. So a lot of the rides right now are ride now or enjoy any time. And then it's got the time of day because you never wear your watch inside a water park. So it's got, wow, I think all of them are enjoy any time. Fantastic. And it's 1.03 in the afternoon. Cool. Here's a bar right off the main area. Um, the Dancing Dragons, and that's where we usually get most of our drinks. It's literally, you can see the water behind them, so that is exactly where like the main swimming pool is. So we walked across and came over here. We have finally found our seating. We have a good view. This is going to be bumpy as heck because I'm trying to Get through the sand. Everyone be vibing with their drinkies. How's your drinking? It's yummy. It's yummy. What'd we get? I got a Calorita. A Calorita? Has tequila. Sounds like tequila. Rum punch. Rum punch. It sounds like it has rum in it. This was rum punch. <laughs> I think it's gone now. <laughs> I think so too. Me, you. Me, oh, I have um, why watermelon? Don't uh, ask me why I got it. Is it is it yeah, vodka it's based? Water, it's, it's vodka. Yeah, <laughs> I have water. <laughs> it's empty, but I'm gonna get some water. <laughs> I can't. I'm gonna go get some footage around the park and see what everything looks like, and then I'll grab the GoPro and we'll go get in the rivers. Why we're waiting on everyone to use the restroom? Mm, I'm gonna go inside the marketplace and see what there is to purchase. Hello. Oh, I love this one. These are really cute. And just in case you wanted a new swimsuit. Plenty of swimsuits and masks. Oh, these little swimsuits are so cute. <laughs> and this is the other side where I think it has more of like adult ladies swim items, hats, Snacks. I might be getting some Volcano Bay merchandise. Oh, yes. Fuel rod charger is in here. Fuel rod charger in here. I've never found a fuel rod charger at any park other than Disney, <laughs> but I have three. The main seating area isn't really that busy but it's also, what, a Tuesday at 2 p.m. So I'm sure it'll be crazy busy on the weekends because it's hot again, but we're gonna go visit the wave pool real quick. Ah, uh, yes. There she is. So 
for reference, we are sitting over there. They have private cabanas over here. More slides, as you can see right there. That's like the clear slide that you go through at the top, slide through. Our hotel is over there. And just more slides way back in the back that wrap around completely. And this is like the main center point. Oh, and they have little life vests. Please place used life vests here for cleaning. And they clean the life vests. It's time for us to get in the lazy river. We're gonna make our way around to where our stuff is and I'm gonna switch out for the GoPro. Run amok reef is for littles that can't handle the big stuff yet. But it's kind of crazy in here. And there's like a little area too over here. As I walked around again, I found another food place to stop and eat. But this one's Hawaiian pizza, jerk shrimp and mac and cheese, and a foot long hot dog. Which smells really good. I don't know if I want a foot long hot dog while on a water coaster, but it might be okay. That just shows how many slides are inside of the volcano and how insane the stairs are. Another food. Stop. Chicken tacos, steak tacos, nachos, and a poke bowl. I have had the chicken tacos from here, and they were good. They were small, but they were good. It's right here, and it's a little frog. All right, this is my first attempt at GoPro footage. How's it look? Oh, you're like a fish. That fits you. Suit it up. I'm just gonna float down here.
Uh, it's getting ready to do the Florida storming, so we are gonna head out and go back to the hotel um, immediately. We got all cleaned up. We're gonna go downstairs and eat at the food court and look around, and I'm gonna show you guys the lobby and all the good stuff. Ha. Hello. I love you. We did get temp checked when we came in the first time, so I've got that band there. Um, and then it, when you get scanned in your hotel, uh, you can wear your band over to Universal and you don't have to get scanned going into the theme park temp temperature wise. And every hotel on property also has like a tiny little gift shop with like all theme park merchandise, Harry Potter, um, the, we saw some Velocicoaster stuff over there. Just Universal itself, Islands of Adventure, uh, Seuss, Minions, Cat in the Hat, Marvel, you name it, it's already in the gift shop. And you could, we can all get matching bowling shirts. Alright, I think this is a robe. That is a robe, towels, shot glasses, mugs, and then there's Simpsons merch as well. I know somebody who loves Simpsons that wants to see them very soon. Alright, so that was most of the main lobby, and then here we have the Bayliner Diner um, where it's kind of like a grab-and-go. There's like different stations with different types of food, and so we're gonna grab something to eat and eat down here in their big like, it kind of reminds me of like a drive-in movie theater kind of setting. I'll show you guys before I go get something to eat. So here's your seating in the dining area. They do have tables blocked off for social distancing purposes but you still have like the old timey cartoons, advertisements, stuff playing. And they have this like really fun mural back here. It just, it looks so cool in here always. And then there are some TVs on both sides and drink stations, Coca-Cola's freestyle machine. Here are the hours currently for if you're coming to dine here. Just like Disney, Universal sells their reusable, refillable mugs. And I think these are Really cute, they're different from the ones that I saw last time I was here. And you've got a choice of uh, black or orange right now. We've got some pre-made salads over here. They look really good. I think Torin decided on some type of sandwich at the wrap sandwich and soup station. This smells so good, oh my god. We got a grilled cheese. Yeah. It smells really good. It's got like two different cheeses on it. Wow, and it goes in a little to-go box so we can go back to the room yep. and do you nothing. Make sure you tell them that you want like. It's everything you would ever need. Two or three pieces. I love kale chips. Bot bot me. <laughs> We're gonna eat a sandwich. We're gonna taste it. Icing. Hi, Hello. <laughs> Good sandwich. Nice sandwich. So the rest of the crew went to City Walk to play mini golf um, at City Walk. And I wanted to stay behind and kind of get some more footage of the hotel and walk around the hotel because I don't really get to be here that often or see any of the Universal hotels. I've seen more of the Disney hotels. So I just wanted to hang out. So we're right outside of the arcade here, there. And then the bowling alley is right behind it. So I'm gonna check out both. We tried to get into the bowling alley tonight, but they were full. So bummer, but that's okay. Got like a prize counter. And now we are inside the bowling alley. They do have a full size bowling alley here that we were unable to get into tonight. But they've got the shoe rental over there, and then they have some dining. As you can see, people were just enjoying a meal. But a pretty good sized bowling alley. I think they have like 10 lanes, nine. Decent size. So right off the main lobby is one of the main pools. 
It's got a huge water slide and a bar and a grill over here. Tons of seating, little cabanas. Looks like so much fun. Everyone's having a good time tonight. There's music playing. Decided to go live here at Volcano Bay. So thank you to everyone who pops in. I'm gonna give everybody like a little bit of a shout out. Like Presley's in here, my parents are in here. These are all new people, other than Brian. He's always hanging out with me. New people in the chat tonight. But I just noticed that we have a little kitty area, little splash pad for the little ones. With the little dump buckets. Oh, I love those. When you were a kid and you went to those water parks with like the big, huge dump buckets. So I love that Universal always has areas for the kids. And the huge water slide. So here are these cabanas here at the main pool. And I didn't know, they're closed off right now for COVID, but I didn't know that they came with like individual TVs. That's cool. And they've got fans and like super soft towels. I can't believe that all of them have TVs. And phones to call the front desk and to call for your food to be brought to you. I can't wait until we're back to normal and then we can do all this fun stuff. Hopefully we all have money by then. They also have a physical fitness center here. And I was looking at this welcome back, stay healthy sign. So the operating hours are from 6 a.m. to 9.30 p.m. But it closes like every hour and a half for cleaning, which is great. I mean, it might be a little bit annoying for everybody trying to work out, but they do clean it. And I don't really know how they clean it, but I didn't get to see that part. So they've got like, I'm like zooming in on this TV back here. I think they have like, this looks like a workout video back there in the back. <laughs> and there's like a surfboard. It's supposed to look like, like the theming of this hotel is 1950s, 1960s. So, but obviously with like a modern twist. So this is 9.30 p.m. on a Tuesday in the lobby. You've still got the guy doing temp checks and they stay out there 24 seven. And then, you know, like two or three people work in the desk over there but everything's closed. So I came up to this touch point and it's got like, it said touch the screen to explore Cabana Bay and there's dining options, drinks, amenities, services, and benefits, maps. So we can click on, so you can see where everything is and where you need to go. Islands of Adventure, Volcano Bay, um, studios. And we are, where are we? We are here. And we've stayed at, in the summer, we've stayed at Adventura, but we haven't stayed at any of these, or Hard Rock, or Portofino. So those will be next on the list. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> <sighs> well, that ends today's vlog, guys. Uh, thank you so much for coming along on today's crazy journey. Thank you so much for watching and making it to the end of this vlog. If you would like to subscribe, I would super duper appreciate it. Or drop a like or a comment. It helps the channel grow and it makes me happy. <laughs> I'm so tired, I can't even think straight. So I will see you guys tomorrow when I go to the first day of Epcot's Flower and Garden Festival. And it'll be a good time. So, good night.